What's going on guys, welcome to my tutorial in Adobe After Effects CS5. In this video I'm going to show you guys how to use a handwriting effect. We're going to get started and I'm going to type out the word Adobe. Let's just make this a little bit smaller and let me create myself a new letter here. And all I'm going to do is take the letters, Control C, Control V, and we're just going to copy over the word. Each layer is going to have its own letter. Now that I have that done, I'm going to delete this layer with Adobe and we just have the letters. So I'm going to start off with this write on effect and this is going to allow us to have handwriting. So I'm going to add the effect to the letter A. Let's change the brush color to something else. And I'm going to increase the brush size to 20. Actually, let's go to 18 and just leave like that. On the timeline, we have the effect and it's right on. So the movie is going to begin and we're going to set one keyframe for the position. We're going to move the marker along the timeline and just bring it up like this. As I'm moving the position, After Effects is adding a keyframe for me. So this becomes very easy to do. Now if you want to check out what you did, all you have to do is click Reveal Original Image. We'll come back here. And that looks pretty good for my first try. So let's continue on to the next letters. I'm going to come over here and we're going to do the same thing. We're going to take the letter D, unlock that. We can actually do this. To save yourself some time, we'll make this brush 18. Control C, so we're copying the effect so we always have it when we add it to the other letters. So let's come over here and on the timeline, right there we want to time this. And let's put the position right there. And then we're going to start off our animation. And when you're doing this, you just need to remember that you're trying to show that it's handwriting, so you want it to be in the direction of how you would actually write the letters. So that's not too bad. Now for the letter O, control V, and I'm adding the effect. Let's bring the position over here. Having done this in Flash, this is a really easy um, or easier way of doing things than in that program. It's a little bit of work depending on the font that you're using, but it's pretty simple. And let's just continue this with the letter B and E. And that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Cheers.